Hello friends. So today we we are going to discuss about the Darlington pair. And you can see here the circuit is super simple circuit with a few components like two transistors. One is SL100 and another one is also SL100. SL, SL100 is quite cheap transistor and it is uh, available about 15 rupees in Delhi. And here you can see these two transistors are connected in a Darlington pair format where the the collectors of these two transistors are connected together and the base of the first transistor is actually connected to a resistance which which is actually doing nothing but just to um, give us protection of to the base the the resistance is actually connected to nothing again and it is just a open-ended terminal here where you can actually touch this terminal and by touching this terminal you you will actually activate this whole circuit so what what is actually happening here is these transistors are connected in a Darlington pair format where the first transistor will require a very very small amount of current to get activated and when you touch here the very small amount of current will flow, flow from your finger to the base of this transistor and this transistor will get activated and when this transistor will get activated current will flow from here from collector to the emitter of this transistor and will go to the base of the second transistor then this transistor will also get activated and large amount of current will flow from positive terminal to the negative terminal of this battery and the light which is acting as a load here will light up so let's let's make this circuit on the breadboard and I have here this circuit already made on the black on the breadboard where I have these two transistors SL100 and another SL100 and I have this lead and I have this resistance here which is not connected to anything you can see the resistance is connected to a wire which is just flying in the air and so this whole circuit is connected to a power supply of 5 volt a constant power supply now I will I will activate the circuit by touching this wire so here we go and you see I'm just touching it and the LED is glowing so so this requires a very small amount of current this is the beauty of the circuit and the, the, the base is actually gets activated by a very small amount of current and as the base of this transistor gets activated a large amount of current will flow from collector to the emitter which will be enough for emitting this for pulling up this LED and if you want to put another LED here you can put another LED here and I think both of these LEDs should glow up uh, I think I connected in the wrong direction so these light emitting diodes should be connected in right with the right terminals positive with the positive and negative with the negative so here we go so you can see and also you can replace these LEDs with with some actual load like bell and you can actually use the circuit uh, as a touch sensor where you can you can use a bell here and you can use a touch plate here and when somebody will touch on this touch plate bell will ring or you can use the circuit in any other application or gadget which you want to make like a quiz or any other application where uh, sensitive touches can be required or sensitive sensitivity is required so thank you